Greetings, beautiful souls. Welcome to Introspective Life Works. Today, we're diving deep into the fascinating world of synchronicities. These intriguing coincidences that seem to hold special meaning in our lives. But did you know that some people believe there's a connection between RH negative blood types and synchronicities? Have you ever experienced synchronistic events? And are you an RH negative individual? Well, get ready to embark on a journey where we connect the dots between synchronicities and RH negative blood types in a truly unique way. Many individuals with RH negative blood have reported experiencing moments of intense synchronicities in their lives where events align in remarkable ways. It's as if the universe conspires to make their desires manifest. Could this be a result of their unique blood type? So what exactly are synchronicities? Simply put, synchronicities are meaningful coincidences that occur in our lives. They are events or experiences that seem to have a deeper significance beyond their surface level explanation. These occurrences often leave us wondering about the interconnectedness of the universe and the hidden messages they might carry. Now that we have a basic understanding of synchronicities, let's discuss how to recognize them when they occur. Here are a few tips to help you identify synchronicities in your life. Intuition and awareness. Stay open-minded and attentive to the subtle patterns or connections that stand out in your daily experiences. Meaningful themes. Look for recurring symbols, numbers, or themes that keep appearing in your life. These can be personal to you or have broader cultural or spiritual significance. Gut feeling. Trust your instincts and follow your intuition. Sometimes a strong feeling will guide you towards recognizing a synchronicity. Now, let's explore some well-known examples of synchronicity experiences that have fascinated people across the globe. Meeting long-lost friends, you may unexpectedly bump into someone you haven't seen in years right when you were thinking about reconnecting with them. I have RH negative blood and my friends that are very close to me have RH negative blood. I feel this could be a mirror type of synchronicity. I asked my friends if they have ever had a person pop into their thoughts only to have that person call them a minute later. They said yes it happens and I have also had this happen quite frequently. Meaningful song lyrics. You might turn on the radio or shuffle your playlist only to have a song play with lyrics perfectly timed to answer a question or provide guidance. I remember a time in my past when I kept hearing the song by T.I. called Whatever You Like, playing on the radio when I went to work and when I'd come home from work. The song came out in 2008, but I was hearing it on the radio repeatedly in 2021, and this went on for weeks until I realized it was a synchronicity giving me the message I needed at the time. If you've experienced this, I'd like to hear about it. Please share a comment. Repeating numbers such as 111, 1111, 222, or 33 are commonly experienced by many people on a regular basis. The interpretation of these numbers can vary from person to person, but here are a few possible explanations to delve deeper into. Some interpret repeating numbers as signs from the universe or higher powers, indicating alignment and guidance on our life path. It's believed that when we repeatedly encounter such numbers, it signifies that we are on the right track and in tune with the flow of life. Repeating numbers are considered a reminder to focus on our intentions and desires. It is believed that when we see these numbers, it's an invitation to pay attention to our thoughts and emotions, align them with our goals, and manifest our desired outcomes. Animals, birds, and insects can indeed be linked to synchronicities. 
The natural world is filled with symbolism and potential connections that can spark meaningful coincidences and synchronistic experiences for many individuals. Here are a few ways animals, birds, and insects can be tied to synchronicity. Some cultures and belief systems consider certain animals as messengers from the spiritual realm or guides in our earthly journeys. Encountering a specific animal repeatedly or having an animal appear in unexpected ways or at significant moments can be interpreted as a synchronistic message or sign. Seeing a particular animal that holds personal significance to you during a significant moment or decision-making process may be seen as a synchronistic occurrence guiding or affirming your path. Synchronicities can also manifest through the timing and behavior of animals, birds, or insects. For example, spotting a rare bird that holds personal significance to you during a time of reflection or decision-making can be seen as a synchronistic moment, prompting you to pay attention to its presence and the potential message it carries. Now let's widen our lens and explore another fascinating synchronicity, finding feathers in places they are uncommon occurrences. Have you ever experienced this peculiar phenomenon? Perhaps stumbling upon a feather in a space where they typically wouldn't appear? Feathers have long been associated with spirituality, symbols of divine guidance, and messages from loved ones who have crossed over. But what does it mean when a feather appears in an unexpected location? Let's examine a few possible explanations. One interpretation could be that it's a synchronistic sign similar to repeating numbers. The feather's appearance could be a subtle message from the universe guiding us on our own path or affirming that we're in alignment with our higher purpose. Another possibility is that finding feathers in unusual places symbolizes a connection to the spiritual realm. Some believe that these magical encounters serve as a reminder that our loved ones in spirit are near, watching over us and sending their love and support. It is not uncommon for those in my circle of friends to exchange insights and experiences of coming across a feather in unexpected locations. Some describe finding a feather on their front porch, even though they lived in an apartment building far away from birds. Others discovered feathers while hiking in remote areas where birds are not commonly seen. I have experienced finding feathers a lot in my life, but in nature it seems so feasible, right? But twice in my life, I have unexpectedly had a white feather appear out of nowhere. I have worked in a manufacturing beef plant for the past 24 years. And one day as I was crossing the catwalk to go to break, a white feather floated right down in front of me. I caught it and I saved it. The next time was also at this job. I was injured on my job and was unable to walk for seven months, but still had to go to work and use a scooter to get around. I was in an office and one day as I was on my scooter heading to the restroom, I saw a beautiful white feather in the hall on the floor. It really made my day and reminded me that although I was experiencing a difficult time, I was not alone. These personal experiences emphasize the mysterious nature of feather synchronicities and highlight the profound impact they can have on individuals. And well, the interpretation of feather synchronicity may vary from person to person, there are a few common themes that arise. First, finding a feather unexpectedly may signal a message to trust your intuition and follow your inner guidance. Consider it a gentle reminder that you are on the right path and making choices aligned with your truest self. 
Second, the appearance of feathers can serve as a reminder to stay connected to the spiritual realm. It invites us to cultivate a deeper sense of awareness and to acknowledge the presence of divine energy in our lives. Finding feathers in uncommon locations adds another layer of wonder to our exploration of mystical experiences. Whether it's a sign from the universe, a connection to spiritual realm, or a message from those we've lost, these feather encounters inspire a sense of awe and curiosity. Magic has captivated humans throughout history, often associated with supernatural abilities and unexplainable phenomena. Many speculate that individuals with RH negative blood possess a natural inclination and affinity towards magic. Let's explore the connection further. Magic is a concept that encompasses a range of beliefs, practices, and phenomena related to harnessing supernatural forces or manipulating the natural world to achieve specific outcomes. It is often associated with mystical or occult practices and is rooted in the idea that there are hidden or unexplained forces that can be accessed and influenced by individuals who possess the knowledge or abilities to do so. Magic can involve rituals, spells, divination, and the use of symbols or objects to channel and direct these supernatural powers. It is a cultural and historical phenomenon that has been present in various societies throughout time with different interpretations and understandings depending on cultural, religious, and personal beliefs. However, it is possible for someone to be involved in or practice magic without being fully aware of it. In some cases, individuals may unknowingly engage in magical practices or rituals due to cultural or religious traditions, family beliefs, or personal rituals that have been passed down through generations. They may perform actions or use objects with the intention of bringing about a desired outcome, even if they do not label it as magic. Furthermore, there are instances where individuals tap into natural or intuitive abilities that can be considered magical without consciously recognizing or acknowledging their practice as such. For example, someone might possess heightened intuition, manifesting abilities, or synchronicities without realizing that they are using magical principles. In essence, magic can be both intentional and unintentional, and it is not solely defined by one's awareness or identification of it as magic. It is a broad and multifaceted concept that can manifest in various forms and degrees, regardless of individual awareness or belief in its existence. Magic is often considered mysterious. The presence of RH negative blood has been linked to heightened intuition and psychic abilities. Some theorize that this blood type acts as a conductor. This could be due to the copper found in RH negative blood, which is highly conductive for the flow of energy, allowing these individuals to tap into unseen energies and forces. RH negative blood has long intrigued researchers due to its rarity and mysterious origins. Some even speculate that it can be traced back to ancient civilizations or extraterrestrial influence. Could this be the key to understanding the connection between magic, synchronicities, and RH negative blood? Many individuals with RH negative blood have reported experienced moments of intense synchronicities in their lives where events align in remarkable ways. It is as if the universe conspires to make their desires manifest. Could this be a result of their unique blood type? My personal point of view is that yes, RH negative blood types can be a witness to the magic of synchronicities that can act as a bridge to the spiritual realm. I know I have had some amazing experiences 
and I am surrounded by RH negatives that have shared their amazing stories with me about the mysterious unknown. The key is being open, being aware, and knowing you are a spirit having a human experience. We are all divine masterpieces created by our creator. I really hope you enjoyed this video and feel free to comment and share your experiences. Thank you for watching and may the universe always have your back. Bye.